Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Ice and Sky. I'm Anthony, and for today's video, we'll do an unboxing. We're gonna do an initial review, and we're gonna play with the best drawing tablet for me, and that is this Huion's Canvas Pro 16. Let's get started. Let's start first with the brand. Huion is a Chinese brand that sets to compete with a pillar in the business, which is Wacom from Japan. They offer competitive digital drawing products, but are a lot cheaper than Wacom's. Around 2010, Huion entered the pen tablet market in China. But it's only until 2016 where they entered the North American and Japanese market. By 2018, they joined Wacom as the only tablet manufacturer that enabled the tilt detection function on their LCD tablets. So with that out of the way, let's get to the actual review. The Huion Canvas Pro 16 is one of Huion's many new tablets in their Canvas line of drawing monitors. Well, in essence, the Huion Canvas Pro 16 is a 15.6-inch version of the previous Huion Canvas Pro 13. You should be careful though not to confuse this tablet with the new Huion Canvas 16, which is a tablet with a similar name but has a different features and specifications. Now here are the specifications for the nerds out there. As for the pricing, it is priced at around 24,000 pesos. I've bought mine at around 23,500 pesos in SM North EDSA. That's roughly around 470 US dollars. Now for the active area of the screen, it's 13.5 inches by 7.6 inches. That's around 15.6 inch in diagonal. For the resolution, it's a full HD. That's 1920 by 1080 pixels with an aspect ratio of 16 to 9. The display type is IPS, which means in plane switching. Basically, IPS panel display is consistent with an accurate color from all viewing angles. It is with a gamut of 120% sRGB on product page. The pen has two buttons with no eraser. But of course, you can customize it using the program. So you can put an eraser in the one of the two buttons. Now for the pen pressure, Huyun also already has 8,192 pressure points. So in terms of sensitivity, it's almost as if you are using a normal pencil or a normal pen. It has a pen tilt sensitivity of plus or minus 60 levels. Now for the shortcut keys in the tablet, it has six buttons with one touch strip, wherein it's fully customizable. Unfortunately, it doesn't have a multi-touch like iPad Pro does. But it has other features such as tablet stand. But some packages that does not include this tablet stand. So it's very important that you ask your seller if the box does include that. It also reduces parallax with a fully laminated display, meaning the tip of the pen is almost a 
as close as possible to the screen of the tablet. The tablet comes in a simple, high-quality black box with the tablet peeking in from the side. So what's included inside the box? The first one is the Huion Canvas Pro 16 tablet. With it is a tablet stand. And as I previously said, please check with your seller if it does include this tablet stand. The second one is the Huion PW507 battery-free pen. It also comes with a donut-shaped pen stand. Inside of it, you'll see 10 pen nib replacement and also a nib remover. It also has a glove which prevents you from smudging the screen or having fingerprint in it. It also comes with a screen cleaning cloth, a user manual, of course the driver installation CD shapes instruction card, a warranty card, a shortcut button function stickers, and lastly, a thank you card. This tablet is a premium looking device and actually feels premium too. This feels sturdy when performing a twist test where I grab both sides of the tablet and try twisting the tablet a bit with just my hands. The tablet comes with an etched glass anti-glare textured screen. This gives it enough resistance to not feel like you're sliding around uncontrollably and it doubles as an anti-glare texture to prevent too much glare from light reflecting off the screen. The Huion Canvas Pro 16 is a sleek looking device with an all black front and a shiny gunmetal rim. This tablet is actually quite small for its screen size because it has a very very thin bezel around the screen. It still won't fit in 15.6 inch laptop bag though but it should for sure fit in a 17 inch or a bigger bag. The Huion Camas Pro 16 is very thin. It has a very very thin bezel that surrounds the screen. It's very very portable as well. However, as I noted before, it is unable to fit in a 15.6 inch laptop bag because it has more length than a 15.6 inch laptops. It's due to the shortcut button area. So if you intend to bring it around with you, you may need to get a new bag if you don't have any larger ones. In front, there are six programmable buttons and one touch bar along the side of the tablet. The two bigger buttons at the top and the bottom are unprogrammable with one of them being the power button. This is actually one of the few things that I don't like on the tablet because it's very easy for you to click on the power button while doing some shortcuts. And the other button in the bottom is the function switch button. The buttons give a nice tactile click when pressed and it's actually not too hard to press. I like the shortcut buttons on a lot of Huion style bits and these ones are very good as well. This tablet utilizes a USB Type-C connection which almost all modern devices have. This is a great design choice because this means that the L-shaped cable can be flipped for left or right-handed use. This is because USB Type-C is a symmetrical design, meaning it can be plugged in either direction. The port has a tunnel in front of it which is there to support the weight of the cable so that the weight of the cable doesn't ruin the power over time. 
the tablet stand which comes with the tablet actually has a good build. It has a front metal plate and a plastic base. It also keeps a good grip on the table and the tablet with its rubber pads. However, the variety of angles that is capable are somehow limited. It has 7 different positions that's 0, 15, 17.5, 20, 42.5, 43.8, and 45 degrees. Well, for me, it's not a problem because usually I use around 15 to 17.5 degrees. The Huyun Canvas Pro 16 comes with a PW507 battery free pen, which is a very welcome addition to the Huyun's product line. It's a premium looking pen with a nice rubber grip, a plastic body, and a silver accent. This pen has a subtle taper towards the top and a bulge near the tip which makes it very very comfortable to hold and use. This is the pen stand which comes with this tablet. It can hold the pen upright or sideways by wedging the pen in the indent on the top. It has a rubber base so it does not slide or move around at all. Now there are three pen nibs, that's around 10 of them, inside the pen stand. It does also include a pen nib remover, that is the metal ring held snugly in the middle. The Huyun Canvas Pro 16 has an okay to good colors out of the box. Well as expected, the colors are not calibrated, but the default settings are okay to start with. Although the default calibration is somewhat off, once you calibrate the display using your colorimeter, the colors displayed become very accurate as expected. Now how do you do that? You should access the OSD settings in this tablet. And you can do it by pressing the bottom most button and holding it. Once you've hold it, a menu will appear and then you will see the picture, display, color, advance, and etc. You can also see the backlight, brightness, contrast, and sharpness.